Hey everybody, welcome back to X4 Cradle Humanity. Today we're going to do a little Terran trading. So if you have followed the earlier videos, you can gain money by doing missions, by mining, and by trading. So the ship you start off with generally isn't a good trader. So once you have enough money, you can buy a dedicated trading ship. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to start off with doing that. Then we're going to talk a little bit about how to trade in the Terran sectors. So let's go to a buy a ship. Make sure you have the wharf discovered. And you've explored some. I would definitely have some exploration and other stations discovered. Since we don't have too much cash, now we're just going to, going to go with a frog. The little frog courier. Not, not much to look at. We'll just do the minimums here. This is a, a low-risk ship. Give it a cr an extra crew person. It doesn't need any of the any of these. It doesn't need docking, targeting. So we're looking at about three three hundred fifty-five k for this, which is pretty expensive actually for a little freighter. It has forty-one hundred storage space. Let's get that built. Okay, so it's about thirty seconds. So we got to figure out what to trade. So I have not really explored all that much. You want to go into the filter settings. Make sure a container is selected. Okay, we're good there. Let's make sure this person is having an issue with me scanning. Okay, and then we can turn on the trade filters. And now you kind of see all of the all the goods here. All right, our frog is done. So, you can either take control of this frog yourself or remotely give it orders. I'm going to remotely give it orders. And just a reminder, when using the map, you see this is taking into 12 op objects. So, it's basically what's on the screen. 15 objects are on the screen. So we get, that's about as much much as we can get listed in this. All right, let's center that a little. Awaiting orders. Okay, so we got fifteen. What should we trade? Well, luckily, it's all kind of right here for you. Bottom is what people sell, and top is what people are buying. So you can see right here, protein paste. That there's a lot of requirements request for it and it's being sold too for 92 and they're paying 134 that's pretty good Terran MREs very little are being requested medical supplies also very little computronic substrate and uh, silicon carbide are also on here but we don't we haven't really discovered much of where they're being produced but protein paste we have a good supply of so what you can do you just right click on protein paste we're at we are our frog drag it all over it's gonna cost 94,000 confirm and then you just go up to the buying person also right click stills the frog it has the, the amount in there and slide it all over this will get us 138 with a total profit of 47k for that run. Then hit confirm. And that is uh, the first way of trading. I'll show you a second way as well. But first, let's take a look at the frog in action. This is it. The frog. All right. So that is method number one of trading. All right, where are you, frog? I need you. Before you, before you land, we got to cancel your orders. Cancel. All right, we canceled. So in a recent patch, which I have to cover this command fully, 
they introduce something called the repeat order. And this is, oh, this person needs a, let me see if I can bump them up. They can't do repeat yet. You need one star for compete. Let's see, for re repeat. Oh, I have a seminar. Nice. Okay. So the repeat order, it's pretty interesting. I have yet to explore this fully, but there's a lot of potential behind it, especially if you want to make like trading routes. So what? How, so we're going to use it to do repeat trades. So you change this over to repeat orders. Make sure to hit confirm, and now things change a little. So we're going to do the same trade. We're going to let's see. We got to find. We're going to buy the protein paste for 92. And now notice you got a different screen here. It's which where to buy, buy up to, and what price, and how much cargo and stuff to use. So you just hit confirm. And then same as before, you go to protein paste for the sell. Minimum price it'll sell for. Quantity and stuff. Hit confirm. And done. So if you look over here, it's got a buy and sell legs now. So it's doing the buy leg and it's doing the sell leg. And you can expand these to see the details of what each one does. Now, what I haven't seen yet is how to do more than a buy and sell. Like, say I want to buy something. I want to buy MREs at this station. But if I go to buy from and then select MRE, I just can't do it. I don't think it's it's smart enough to know that yet. So it's more one-way trading lines, it seems. But maybe someone else out there knows differently and can uh, shed some light on the comments. But here we go. There's our uh, our little frog. Remember the keys are to explore, and this data will go out of stock, will go uh, expire. So get satellites out there. Trading protein paste is a great first trade. You just might have to wait for some things to be built, and then you're on your way. You start your trading empire. That's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.